For fuck's sake. Sapnin people, thank you very much for clicking on the video. It's much appreciated as ever. If you are new around here, basically in a nutshell, what I try and do is entertain you on a weekly basis. It doesn't always work. You know, when it does, it's all right. So, might as well subscribe. Right, today's video, breakthrough, yeah. It turns out that uh, Bigfoot is real. And not only has Bigfoot now been proved, yeah, and don't worry, I've got video evidence of this. It's only gone and been proved by a bloody YouTuber who goes by the names of Peter Kane Dog Training. But don't let the name fool you. No, he doesn't just do dog training. Apart from having solid proof that Bigfoot exists, he also has experience of examining Frogman. So, you know, he's well up there with like NASA and scientists and stuff. Well, on these experiments, he has a lot of very important people there with him. We have 11, um, 11 people that are witnessing this autopsy. We have uh, a couple titans of industry. We have uh, a scientist, a doctor, a poet. We have a, we have a lot of people in the room here to witness this. Yeah, you convinced me. I'm not gonna lie. Today is I'm gonna use a small camera and and see what is in, you know, it's 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 cranium. I don't think you're gonna uh, you're gonna find too much. To be fair, it just looks like a massive paper mache project that you've done. Oh no, I stand corrected. Are those crystals? It looks crystallized. It's found some some glitter. It's exactly what I thought would be in a frog man. But yeah, let's see how Peter Kane dog trainer. Yeah, has proof that Bigfoot existed. Do you know what that little uh, intro is? Uh, is missing something. I'm president of the Bigfoot community and president of the Bigfoot Association. This is, this is totally real. Cool, bloody hell, someone's defensive. Oh yeah, hi, I'm a president of the Bigfoot committee. This is real, by the way, it's fucking real. Please explain to me, Peter, how do I know this is real? It has flies, it has like those bees on it. Oh, oh, it's got flies and bees. <laughs> bloody hell, that makes sense now. I mean, if it was fake, the flies and the bees wouldn't you know wouldn't be interested would they if if it wasn't real there would not there would be no flies on it there's a fly on it see that's a fly it's a fly cool learning a lot with this geezer i now know confidently what a fly is so uh that's good i have to hide the bigfoot hand i have to hide it because the government will come and take it. What better way to hide it than to post it on YouTube in front of your 90,000 subscribers. Very subtle technique you got there. I like it. Got any more proof that it's real? You know, the flies and the bees, it's convincing, but you know, I need something uh, a bit more solid. So come on, Peter, what you got? Watch this. Because I forgot that Bigfoot is known for his bloody magnetic powers. How is that even possible? I forgot. I forgot that. How do you... <laughs> See the bug on there? There's a bug on there because it's meat. It's something to eat. Oh, and, and there's a bug on there at the same time? Bloody hell. I don't care what anyone says or thinks. Definitely Bigfoot's hand. For fuck's sake, yeah. All right, yeah, it's magnetic. Definitely, definitely real. To prove to you all that Bigfoot's magnetic powers are a very strong force, yeah, he then decides to show us a few more objects that can uh, stick to Bigfoot's hand through its magneticness. Yeah. Watch this. How's that possible? How can that be? <laughs> uh, that's funny shit, innit? I mean, the flies, the wasps, the magnetic powers, it all seems 
you know, believable. But I don't know. Is this guy legit? Has he, you know, has he really been keeping this for years in a freezer? Well, don't worry. Peter, our buddy old pal, has uh, provided some evidence of this. Proof I'm not a hoaxer. Here is the freezer. All you disbelievers out there, yeah, is proof that he's got a, a fridge. Check this out. Look at this. You don't think that this freezer's big enough to have a bunch of Bigfoot in? It is. It's giant. It's, it's just a door. I mean, like, it's, it's just a door. Yeah, it's a, it's a big door. But it's, it's just a door. This is a freezer that's kept very, very cold. That's why I have a glove on. I mean, if it wasn't a freezer, he definitely wouldn't put a glove on. So, you know, once again, he's uh, he's proven us all wrong, isn't he? That's how cold this re freezer is kept. See, there it is. Now I'm closing it. Oh, uh, pitch black. Can't, can't see anything. So, uh, yeah. I mean, it's definitely a, a freezer, 40 foot under the ground, where he keeps Bigfoot parts. Magnetic Bigfoot parts. How is that even possible? So, yeah. Oh, this guy is a genius. Anyway, that is it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed. If you did enjoy the video, if you wouldn't mind giving it a thumbs up, that would be great. Subscribe for weekly shit videos like this sold it i'll be back with a video next week until then take care and i shall see you soon that is on